Good morning, everybody. It's the Allen Street Vlog. Welcome back to Desert Sky Adventures and welcome back to Tombstone. I'm out here bright and early this morning. It's about 35 degrees out here this morning. And uh, yesterday we had reported on the uh, Telus building or maybe Tell Tell Yes Tell Yes building over here on Allen Street. That uh, rumor had it the building was coming down. And we can now confirm that building has indeed been demolished. I came by yesterday and got some shots of some of the early stages of the demolition. Couldn't really see a whole lot. They had everything roped off, but I did the best I could to see behind the buildings here. Got some information this morning from Lily, who owns Lily's Tombstone Memories right there. And uh, I found out that she actually owns this area too. And she said in the video that the building was uh, structurally unsound. It would have cost a lot of money to repair. And there's only so many companies that can do that kind of repair work anyway when we're talking about old Adobe and stuff like that. And apparently they're booked out for quite some time. So. repair of this building not feasible. So we were wondering yesterday when I was down here filming some of this demolition if the facade would remain and everything behind it would go but no as you can see the whole thing has been torn down and at this time we don't know what is going to take its place or how long it will take to get something done. I understand it there were a few people who were upset with the news of this building coming down and I don't know how old that building was. I'd imagine it probably wasn't 1881 original, but still quite old. But I'm not really sure. So if you know the answer to that, tell me down in the comments, because I'm kind of curious myself as to how old this building actually was. I've had people ask me, and I don't know. I tried to find some information online about the history of the building, but couldn't find too much. I've had people tell me that it is an original building from the 1800s. I've had people tell me that it's not. Here's a picture believed to have been taken in the 60s when it was a cafe. But yes, some people were upset either about the hole that is now on Allen Street or the demolishing of a very old, if not historic, building. And as the owner was explaining in a video she put out to social media, the back of this building, well, what looks like the back, again, there was a roof, but there was no back wall. So whenever there was a storm, essentially there'd be a giant pool of water underneath the roof part of the building where it used to be and it was causing the adobe to crumble and the walls were starting to lean a little bit and making a repair on something like that not very feasible something that would cost a lot of money and take a lot of time to complete and just didn't seem like something that could be done so we just come down Original building or not, there were people around town who were very upset about it getting demolished. In fact, the city even put out a letter here saying that there was basically nothing they could do about it. They looked into it, the experts checked it out, and it's just a building that cannot be repaired. It's dangerous, and it needs to be taken down. I was hoping to actually get some footage of that building coming down, but we had no idea when that was going to happen. And by the time I got here this morning, it was already done. And speaking of abandoned buildings, this is the Madame Mustachery building on Allen Street, which has been vacant for, I want to say, several months now. There used to be a store here called the Right Side Patriot, but they kind of vanished into thin air one day, and this building's been sitting here vacant ever since. Just look through the window. I imagine at some point someone will buy this. This is prime real estate right in the middle of the historic district. Just a little more follow-up on the renovation update over here at the courthouse. You can see today they are still working on the windows. Coming back by a little bit later in the day now. And everything 
in this spot has been cleared away. Except for the old building sign, which is still right there. Maybe someone will keep that for purposes. I don't really know. But they didn't trash it for some reason. But everything else in this space has been cleared away. So I want to know, what are your thoughts on this building coming down? Is it a piece of tombstone history lost? Or a necessary step towards progress keeping the town alive? But that is it for today. I thank you so much for joining me. And until next time, until the next video, we'll see you down the road.